Hi folks, uh, maybe you've seen this thing before. This one does not have the metal counterweight on the back or the legs that a wheelbarrow might have. But this does have a chain and a hook that I put on it now so that I can go out and I have to move the little one and I will show you this will be a brief overview this is tight from this side if you can see I've got the four tripods one was just a little one I may use that actually but the fire mama bear in the back I am going to leave this one here and I'm going to leave the big one I may demonstrate that I can move the big one with that thing but I am going to I don't think I'll film the whole thing if I do, I better put it on 40 speed. But I want to move Mama Bear over here <laughs> in between my little shack studio and that tree and try to negotiate that thing in and around that area through the tree and the big tripod and the stuff right here. And I want to set it up in front of this basketball net because that right there is where I showed you in the other video where I want to cut. I'm going to make my mark. Anyway, there's a shot of the mast if anybody cares. It goes up a good distance. Of course that goes up even farther as you can see. There's an ascension. Alright, well anyway, I'll set up and show you more as I move in a minute. No laughing. But my two round, those actually were, uh, <laughs> we tapped a few trees one year and I made a couple gallons of maple syrup. So I took some aspenite that was kicking around and made little covers for it. And if you look even, the covers had little holes for the spouts to go in. See that little uh, notch there? I think the other one has one too somewhere on the other side. But oh yeah, there it is, full of snow. <laughs> anyway, I'll connect this up and show you how I pried because for me to do this at the same time is going to be kind of tricky. So just a second. So just a quick little segue shot in this just a second. And there's the little... I suppose you'd call it the tripod lifting jack dolly wheelbarrow contraption and as you've seen there's the scroll saw and mama bear and the chains and such are going to end up getting moved way over there and so here we go hmm an eight pounder and a 20 pounder i'll pick this one Okay, so there's the impression where it was. And All right, so I got it set up for another one. Just give it a little pull, and it comes pretty good, like so. And you unhitch the chain and go to the next one. I'll grab my gloves because I am not in Florida. On this one, I can cheat a little bit, kind of just without breaking the foot do this a little well as you can see that's as far as I moved it so far this is one of the things that Ed would have done with the lights at night because <laughs> it's kind of manual alright well I moved it six feet or so more later so I just want to demonstrate how the wheelbarrow pronged thing moves the feet around pretty well. Okay, back from break. I uh, 
had earlier cut down a bunch of little tiny little dry pine twigs off of a big tree and some little apple and now I got it roaring in there and it's about 20 out I'm gonna have some sanctuary well I've moved it a little bit like I said six feet and I will go back to moving it some more NASCAR <laughs> Northern Circuit this one's a shout to Roy well the handle broke on the pole lifting mechanism <laughs> never thought I'd be using it but I'm using it and actually one handle works okay for now well here we are still snowing I got it over this far now I gotta kind of jostle it into place these things almost walk by themselves you get a little twist on them and you know where they're going the next leg just waddles along and the last one follows and the first one's ready to go the next time around and somewhere under the snow there is a spot I started cutting which I don't even know where it is now anyway and there it is well there's my first slice into the earth it's getting there pretty good it's in I don't know if you can see that but that's a that's a pretty good little crevasse but there's a quick concept I'll lay on it's called ice it cleases up won't cut over and out